Mr. Morris. Hello, Hi, Mr. Morris. How are you? How are you? All right. Yeah, I went to the gym. I, I, I spent two and a half hours in the gym oh. on, on 11 machines pumping away. Oh. <laughs> so oh. so that's where I, I should have left the message, oh, I'm going up the gym. So he won't ring me. Yeah. Hey, um, oh. hey. Um, I, I was talking to the lawyer uh, yesterday and um, um, he wants me, I was going to wait for the the documents I've, I've put together yeah. and um, I've, I've been recovering myself and and um, I'm back on form now and tomorrow I'll, I'll finish off the book and email it to him. He's waiting for it and on Monday uh, or next week he's told me to get my passport updated for an ID for the for the documents the postally and all that, uh, so that's to make me fit the fit the the the, the part of uh, of that legal part, and um, he hasn't made any cost yet because he said I needed to go in. Or um, I, I think initially I'll go in, and then when we're ready for you, I'll, I'll bring you in. I'm hoping that I can get something down next week because it takes. It takes seven days to get a passport. That's just for identification yeah. uh, purpose for, for legal, for, for government stuff and um, for the British stuff as well. Uh, so they can't just take a driver's license here. They needed something of a bit more profile. Um, so that part, I've, I've got to do my passport tonight and um, I've got enough money for that. Now, there's about 180 bucks, man, to renew a passport, and and that's all the all the photo that you had before is it's no good. You've got to make a new one, hey? Yeah, hell. Wow. Uh, I knew I knew that, so I didn't want to get it until I necessary to get it. But now now that now that he's, yeah yeah yeah. Yeah, so oh, man, that's good news, yeah, that's good news because he he, he he hasn't said no. He said he needed to go over it with me, and so that should that shouldn't take too long to skip through the documents that I just did and showed you. That that'll be more more better than the other ones, all put together. So, so that's with the original history with your. Um, 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 Hidemeyer's photo or photos to complete that side of your title and I'm putting I said to him hey eh? yeah you try you, yeah 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 Oh, when you when you find time, because I'm I'm going to go through these books again, the ones you gave me to look through, to see if I can find something else to put in. But I think that's enough. I think I've got enough with those, uh, the the 1834 date. That's important. The 1834 date on that document. Oh, Marianne. Hey? Marianne. Where's, hey. you, where's Marianne? Is she talking to you? No. Oh, somebody was, a woman was talking. Oh, that's the TV. Hey? Oh, the that's TV. The TV. <laughs> I thought, oh, that's a woman. She's <laughs> She's asleep. She's asleep. Oh, I see, I see. She's here, she's here. Uh, she's back, she's back on the tomorrow. Oh, okay, okay. So, so that's that's the good news. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, that's um, awesome. I said. Well, I'll tell you something. Yeah. There's something happening up here. Oh. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, Tyreek is talking about King George. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they think you were that faithful, brother. Yeah, yeah, they, 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 they. It's, it's all. <laughs> it's so it it's Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. They can That's right. Yeah. They don't worry about us. They got the guy they are copy. They're copycat. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No idea. Yeah, 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 well, that. Yeah, yeah, that, they will do that, but it all still comes back this way because. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That that's why I'm not worried about what they do. Who what? Oh, found it. Where was it? Was it a trick ball on the table? Holy hell. <laughs> you better apologize to the cat. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah. He's trying to open the door. <laughs> He's got oh, good. That's good. That's me and you. I started today. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 The treadmill. Yeah, that's good. That's a good sign. Yep. That's. Yeah. That's good. That's good that you started a little bit today, a little bit tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Okay. You put on two kg. Oh yeah. So, so you'll have to get it off. Your phone is funny. <coughs> your your phone is not. It's just the land phone, eh? It's it's a little scratchy. Yeah. The witch or the phone? Oh. Oh, it's got my, my. Oh hell. Oh well, you can you know my number? Just dial it with your little finger. <laughs> oh, no, no, just dial it normally. You'll have to dial it normally until um, Miriam should be able to put it in, or some someone can. When you get a, one of those clever cutters, ask one of them to put put your number in it. They, they can they can put it in. Yeah. 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 Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. 
We are running them up from here. Uh, uh, I rang them up from here to tell them that they that, that I cancelled it with Spark, and, and chorus came out. The chorus, the, the contractors came out. I said, "No, you fellas are not supposed to go out because I've fixed it. It's all fixed. You didn't need to do anything." So what they did was they jumped the fence and went up to the house. That's what they told me. Yeah, they went up to the house to check the outside. And I said, well, 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 we weren't there. There was nobody there. We told you guys we're going down to Auckland. There won't be anybody there. And don't go there. And so that's what they did. They jumped the broom fence and went in, into the house. Or not into the house, on the outside. Yeah, uh, if I open the gate, I can see I told them they're not ex you're not expected to pay the pay the. Yeah, it's on their record. They're telling me that they're not expected to pay the bill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, we got good news. We we got good news from the from the lawyer, and and, and uh, so he, he the next thing he needed to do was for me to sit down and explain a bit more about who how it works. Uh, he's had a, uh, he's had his read through it, but he still needed to to um, make sure what's being uh, what's being written, so that I can claim it. Um, and then when it's your turn, I said to him, we'll bring you in when, when it's your turn. Yeah, because he'll go, I'll go over your one. I'll go over your one with him and, uh, and straighten your one too. Um, because I, I, know, I know what your one is all about. Um, uh, and so it'll be next week uh, sometime. Um, I'll, I'll get my pass. Hey? Was, yeah, no, I told him that um, uh, uh, you wanted to know how much the bill is going to be. And he didn't say anything about a bill. He just said, I'd need to go in. They, their time is when, when we're in the office. He, he said it, it might take a half an hour to an hour of work to, to, to look at and, and to, uh, to seal it. And so, if it's only going to take a half, that's what he said to me today. It it should take a half an hour to an hour for me to go in, and to to go over the documents with him. And then, if he says your one is okay, then there's no need for you to come. He'll seal the whole lot. You see, that that's all I wanted. But he wanted the passport, so it's going to take as long as the passport comes back from from the government. Um, whether that's three or four, four or five days or something, eh? Hey? Yeah, yeah. No, no. We'll wait. We'll wait till he he sorts it out. It, they usually charge when you go into the office. Oh, we we'll wait. We we we'll, we'll wait. We we'll just wait till till um, he he does it when I go in. We we have to wait till I get my passport sorted first, and I got to get. I've, I've got, eh? I can't hear you. Yeah, yeah, that's all right. Yeah, I know. There's enough, there's enough there for now um, to do things. Oh, and what's that? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I can. Do yeah, we should we should be able to get some headway next week. We sh we should be able to get some headway next week. It's only going to take how long it takes me to get the passport. Yeah, no, it's good from from his point of view. So he's he's looked at it, but he knows what it is. But he wants me to sit down and explain a few. He's going to ask me a few questions. 
And if he, if, if I satisfy him, he'll sell it. And I'll, I'll try and cover your one as well. But when I do this today, tomorrow and Sunday, I'll be doing the, the rest of your stuff up. If I don't get um, anything from you, I'll use what's in the book. Uh, that that statement and how did you, um, and Hiramai. I'll, I'll use Hiramai for. What's that? What's that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've got them here because I want to go and look. I want. Hey. Eh? Yeah, no, I need to go right through the the whole books. I need to go right because I'm going to explain him of those blocks of yours, and and I did tell him that you'd need a lawyer. Uh, any case, if he can be our lawyer for our business, because it it looks like. I'm going to be uh, helping you fellas on your on your your business to get you going uh, uh, until you're all set by yourself. I'll I'll be I'll be a co-director for you. Uh, eh? Oh no, he just said, um, uh, "Oh, we'll 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 just go through the documents that he's got." And pick out what's the best out of that one and this one I've, I'm, put, I'm going to send to her. Yeah, I think this one I did is better than the other ones. And, and, and much, much easier to follow the, the three chiefs and the three kings. That's it. The three kings and the three chiefs. And that, that makes the British title. Um, uh, it cuts out a lot of other issues uh, that we don't need to talk about apart from me and you succeeding to those three chiefs. Yeah. Um, oh, the other thing, the other thing is, I found where your, your phone is gone. I had cancelled uh, an order for something else and I, and I, I did the wrong one. Hello? Yeah. Uh, I, oh, that's clearer now, you did something. I can hear you now, all the scratching is gone. Uh, oh, yeah. So, that's better, whatever you did. Um, so uh, I'm going to order another one. That, yeah. It, uh, oh, oh, you can get used to that one, but well, I can still get that one at any time. Yeah, I can get it at any time uh, when you when when the, when the time comes to use it. But in the meantime, you. <laughs> I'm gonna solder it all up, the Blumenazis. The bloody Australia, Australia, it's come from Australia. I didn't know it was going to come like that. The, the Chinese ones come one piece, but these, I've got to solder it up. I've got to know where to solder everything up. It's all in a kit set form. And it can, I didn't know that, but it's very expensive, but that's how they made it cheaper. Uh, but I could have got the same thing from China. Would have taken a bit longer, but... Um, I, I, I would have had the same result with it all complete, but I can put it all together. I'll, I'll just post it up to you when I'm finished uh, soldering it together. I'll, I can test it out on, on the phone here, and then I'll post it up. Yeah. 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 I, I've got enough money for now, so there's no need to to do that um, to send any yet. Um, I'll just I'll just um, see how we get on. Um, I'll get I'll, I'll 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 do that for next week. Okay. Oh, the other thing, one more. Um, the boy is on my site as as a friend now, so I told him keep short, and uh, he's he's watching my site now. We won't say no more. I don't know. I don't know where it is. I, I don't know where he is. Toko. Toko's on my Facebook site now. And no, I, 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 I can keep in touch. I'll keep. I'll keep an eye. I'll keep an eye. No, we don't know where he is. And I'll keep. I'll keep an eye on. I'll keep an eye on him on Facebook. He did respond, but um, but. That's the only thing I'll, I'll, I'll he, as long as he can see what we're doing, wherever he is, I'm, I'm just saying I'm not to know where he is, but he's on Facebook as well. As long as he's on Facebook, 
then he's, he's communicating. I can keep an eye on things there. Okay? Okay, mate. Cheers. See you. Bye. That's our mate, Lobo. Um, I'm having corn and butter fried chicken. Butter, butter, oh. Butter curry chicken from my shop up town. Cheap enough and, and fresh corn. The corn is really nice. Really nice. That's my dinner. This butter chicken, curry, and corn. I went to the gym today. I did two and a half hours, about two and a half hours to three hours on 11 machines. I passed. My trainer looked at me in surprise. He said, oh, if you need a hand, I said, I'll see. If you hear me putting out, then come and rescue me. Well, I did pretty well, all right. Pushed the machines. Not as hard as I could, but enough. Um, so, uh, today, with the lawyer, I'm satisfied with his response of why he didn't call me is that he's waiting for me to go and see him. I won't go and see him till I get this last bit done of a completely rehashed apostate. That one should do the trick because it's the three chiefs and the three kings I'm just explaining to Morris on YouTube. Fact cited evidence of King George the Fourth and Terawakato Whare Here Here Manukau of Mangatoturi Mountain in Cambridge area <coughs> county Pohara Punga Punga Marae. I'm going to set up a meeting there with my father-in-law's family and we're going to go for it and recover the title from Tainui for that mountain and put the mana back into Pohara Punga Punga Hapu Marae. I'm going to open up that marae as a Punga Punga Marae Native Magistrate Court, the biggest one in this country. That's where the money lies, to Britain, UK, through Cambridge, here in New Zealand, to Cambridge, England, where Te Rā Waikato Whare Here Here went to learn English and to learn contracts, legal documents, and land transfer. That's what he did in Edinburgh, Magistrate Court, transferred this country into British Crown title. British Crown under King George IV Crown land patent titles in Edinburgh. Magistrate Court under Lieutenant William Cornwallis Simons, Magistrate. Okay, that's how it happened. They made a contract for the whole of New Zealand and Pacific Islands that no one's ever seen. That's no one's business because it's a two party contract between me, Morris Baker, and Sir Philip Jones, First Lord of the Sea of the British Royal Navy. That's our legal partner, Ship of Admiralty, Court Martial Law in Edinburgh, Magistrate Court, land titles to this country, New Zealand. As a blueprint, Te Rawaikato Whare Here Here Manukau. Punga Punga Hapu Morai, Native Magistrate, put those titles together with the King. And 
I'm holding those titles. Deeds to this country and the rest of the indigenous countries in the world as a patent, a land patent that I'm apostolizing as the king's emperor's land patent title to all their wealth and all their prized possessions of conquered lands right throughout the world belongs to the king and his successors, his partners in commercial trading bank magistrate business with us, the paramount chiefs of Altair, New Zealand. This has nothing to do with the Whakaminia, Maori or Iwi or anything to do with the Queen. They have their own contracts with the New Zealand government and their invented Maori Iwi tribes. It is not true or real. It's baseless. Whakapapa is Ngāti Whātua. Iwi Crown Māori Corporate Trusts defrauded the public of New Zealand and Pacific Islands and in particular their original native paramount chiefs equal to the king in contract private contract so there you go people I'm just telling you a true story. Today and every day I'm on YouTube to swear to tell the truth and nothing but the truth, so help me God. Moai statue is a face of God, spirit of his earth, planet, world. There, I said. Fact cited evidence to Tony Fortune, my lawyer, notary. <coughs> I will complete this title for sealing within the next two weeks when I get my passport. He asked me today to get my passport. It's on YouTube so that you can see how this is all going together and it won't be covered up by this government in New Zealand. It shall not be tampered with either. I'm libeling the New Zealand courts and Andrew Little, the Minister of the Courts, for the missing money from my account that I spent one and a half days to two days looking for the miss missing money that for my parking fine $40 went to $147 I'm looking for it because the court says it can't find it justice fines that's the name of that company, Justice Fines, said I haven't paid it. Even a bank statement that says I paid it into their court bank account, court fines bank account, they still can't find it in that account. I'm surprised they can't find it. At least four people I rang in the courts can't find it. They said, John, if you don't pay it, we'll give you one day. If you don't pay it, then you're going to get $200 charged against you for penalties for not paying up because it's overdue. That's what they're saying. It was an old 2012 bill that I settled last year. They said I hadn't settled it. Well, I'm sending 
the printouts, the screen print of those payments. Seven payments at twenty dollars each to the courts to show them how incompetent and useless they are at tracking down a payment. It's got a reference number there to the parking fine in Auckland District Court where the order went from. One court department can't communicate with the other court department. This fines department had no record of my address here. No, no record at all of me. And they expect me to just pull out the evidence, prove that I've paid the bill. And it's paid into their account. They can't find it, they said. Sorry, John, we can't find it. It's not there. It's just no reference. You'd need to give us a reference. Well, the bastards have got a reference on their account, on my account. Their reference and my reference is sitting right there with a number on it of the case in the Auckland District Court. Well, I'll charge them for wasting my time and inconvenience because it's stuff of my day. I had things to do with my lawyer and he'll have another job to do, investigate the courts because that's what I'm doing. They lost against me and covered up the 77 Cook Street fraudulent title transfer. And that's what I'm talking about with this Tera Waikato Whareere Manukau. Names are missing on their Lynn's land transfer. Where did they get the titles from? Where, where did they get their, their titles from? They've come out of these Manukau chiefs. Refere for Manukau and Te Rewakato Wharehere Hede Manukau's titles to Britain. They can't show it. So I'm going to take that off them. I'm, I'm going to remove them off these fucking lands. I'm going, to, I'm going to build them first, then boot their ass out. I'm going to shut them down and do the job myself. I'll run this whole country myself. I'll just about do it now. I'll run the court myself and I'll do the whole blade lot myself, digital, and put people on contract. I'll save all that money for these shit ministers who can't do the job and they're filling their own pockets as private companies. Judith Collins, that's the bitch that's peeling off the money with her Chinese husband. I'm going to wreck the bill against you. I'm going to seize all your properties, Judith Collins, because I've been after you for a long, long time as a crooked, fraudulent bitch. Right on this video. And you can't do anything about it. Because I'm going to make you show me your title, where you got it from. If you can't show me, I'm going to boot your fucking little fat ass. Your white fat ass off these lands. And I'm going to remove everything and seize everything from you. That goes for every other minister as well. Because... I can name the whole lot of you and there's fuck all you can do about it because you can't prove to me, you silent, shut your fucking mouth and say nothing and ignore me no more. No more. I've got a top lawyer now looking at my documents and making his mind up who is telling the truth and who is bullshitting who. He can take a good look in the mirror, marry Iwi, and own up who the fuck you've been all these years defrauding the public of New Zealand and me and my paramount chiefs. Very few of them. In fact, there's very few of them. They've all walked off on me and Lobo, Morris Baker. They've walked off and abandoned him and, him and I with title deeds, British title deeds. If you haven't got a British title deed, I'm afraid you can't use this flag because it's for British title deeds. It's not for Maori. 
this flag wasn't given for Maoris. Check me out and see if I'm telling the truth. Because I'm saying Maori is a fraudulent tribe, run and owned and created and invented by the Crown Corporation's Pākehā private interests. Ngāti Whātua. I'll say that one more time. Ngāti Whātua is an equivalent of ISIS of the United States of America, US federal state government, Americans created ISIS to fight their own people, with their own people. They're stupid bastards. The same with Maori. Made them fight their own people for their own private corporate elite families businesses. We're going to whip the whole lot of you. Today I saw an article from President Rodriguez Duterte. Rodriguez Duterte, I'm coming to the Philippines because I have a wife there that is waiting for me, patiently, over patiently. And her name is Menez Flores. I'm coming there to help you sort out where the gold is and whose gold it is and we'll split it because it's safer under the ground or where it's hidden in your country. I'll come there because the trust that has come out of is the Queen Victoria Trust. I'm seizing all of that as well. I'm seizing everything off the Queen and hang her. I'm going to hang her. Did you hear what I just said on this video? I'm going to hang the Queen because she has corrupted the King's titles with the Rothschild banks. She has killed innocent children and played with them and their poor souls, drank their blood and murdered them, and in the churches as well. The thieving bitch has murdered children in the indigenous countries and put the paedophiles in there to rape and maim them and destroyed their lives and their families. Well, Maui is going to destroy your life off this planet for doing all of that to innocent people under the King's common law. Those are the King's people. You are wrecked their lives, Queen. Like Queen Mary, she got executed. You're the next Queen to be executed for your horrendous crimes of church and state. The church is there to frighten people into submission. No more. President Duterte kicked Americans out of Philippines as well. So Trump, you can't go there. No more. And I'm sick of Americans' bullshit as well. The sooner they've got rid of, and Israel got rid of, the better. The sooner those two, and the Rothschilds, and the Queen, and her families, all disappear out of this planet, off, the better. It is for everybody in the world, and I'm holding the native titles to the whole planet Earth. I'm holding those titles on behalf of all the Paramount Chiefs in the indigenous native countries, <coughs> with their lands being stolen by the Queen, not the King, by the King, by the Queen, and her royal families, elite people, having a good life, and sponging off the common law people of this world. So that's what I want to say at this stage. I'm serious, I'm pretty serious with what I'm saying. I'm making these claims against all those people who have wrecked this economy, wrecked the countries, wrecked the, the, the land, wrecked the air, spraying the skies, killing the bees, poisoning the food and the water, chemtrails and all the rest of it, oil spilling everywhere. That's white man Pākehā law. And the white man created all those laws. 
the black man didn't do it. It's come from Britain and Europe and Russia and America. The Americans are runaway British people. They are runaway European people. They are runaway white people. And they are playing havoc on the black people's land. So to the black people, it looks like you'll get your land back and manage it yourself. Boot those people off it, keep the ones you want, and boot the rest off like Trump. They're only in it for themselves, to line their own pockets, and to make people suffer. He's not a good man, I can tell you that. He's not a good man. Any real estate person who's out for a buck doesn't care about anybody's well-being. They're on it for themselves. Now, seeing I said that much, I'm going to ring money and see how he's getting on. Your prepaid account balance is less than $10. Kia ora, manahi Yeah, money, John Wano are here. Um, <coughs> I can't get you in the mind. That's all right. I'll try again sometime. Kill up. So that's money. You see, when I ring somebody, I expect to get them, just like Lobo. When I ring Lobo or Morris Baker, I get him. That's why I gave him my phone. I gave him my mobile phone, just in case he's not home. He's got a mobile phone. I can ring him. That's how you run a business. Somebody's got to be on the end of the phone all the time. Because if you're not, you lose the sale. That's the way I say it. I'm going into business again. I've been in business before, commercially. And I'm going to make sure that when I set up one business on Morris's farm, it will set a precedent case for here on Maryland. And I'm going to set up Cook Street. I'm going to seize Cook Street off those landowners. James Pierce Brown and Simon Brent Roundtree, you're on your last legs. The lawyers are going to swoop in on you for me. We're going to pay them, him, them, we're going to pay them to finish you off. Because you've got away with it right up to now. I'm going to finish you off with the law. I've got my own law. I'm going to use the law of New Zealand to finish you off. I override the laws of New Zealand with the King's laws. I'm here for the King. I'm speaking for the King as a King's surrogate. And I can do what I like with the law that you created your laws out of, subordinate to me and the King's bench court laws. <clears throat> Uh, the other thing is uh, just um, updating my bank accounts today to reconcile and find out where all my money's gone because I don't check my accounts. And lo and behold, the courts have made a boo boo, but I'm going to sting them for that. I'm going to hold them liable for corruption in the bank system of birth certificates, births, deaths and marriages. And Shannon Withers, you, you bastard, from Vulcan Chambers, lawyers, I'm going to sue the whole fucking lot of you as well. I'm not sue you, I'm going to build you a trillion pound bond on your head for tampering with my information. You use my information, Shannon Withers, you use my information and left me out of my court hearing. I never got my court hearing. That's why I'm going to my own court. Because I've tried everything in your court system. Didn't work for me. So now I'm going to use my court system on you. A lot of thugs, I call you. Pirates on a high sea. So Willie Pater has told me that they're going with the flag on the sea. The fucker men here, 38, tribes, Whakamininga, is 
calling this flag the flag of the sea with the New Zealand Navy. They were in deep shit. The New Zealand Navy for joining with the Whakamania, whoever you are, and you were a you didn't know how serious I'm talking when it comes to contracts in that flag is a contract. It's not your contract. You can talk all you like about Whakapapa and King William. Now it's all King George. Why are you people talking about King George? You've never talked about King George before. You're reading my script and what I'm writing. Well, we've gone further than King George. We've gone back to King William III. And there you can't go. Those are the eight-point stars on the flag. You're not a Patrick. You're not a Cosgrove. You're not a Rogan. Or you're not a Wainwright. Those names are joined in law to the Manukau's. <coughs> they married, the Rogans married the Manukau's and the Wainwright's. And that's where the Ratna came in. But the Ratna church is not the same as the Maui Crown Corporation. The, the, the Maui Crown Corporation was started by Queen Victoria in 1868 when she took, or stole rather, stole the first Maui off Rapa Nui East Island and took him to England and hid him for a hundred years. That's my title, Mana Whenua, to the whole world through Britain, sitting in Queen Elizabeth's Great Court in London. I'm claiming that back. That title belongs to me, the Wānoa Hapu of Rapa Nui to Mokonui on my land block at Marangaro, East Coast. Tipito there to Tipito, East Island. Rapa Nui and Raiatea Island, my one or people there too. Okay, so between those names and the Patrick name in Northern Ireland, the Rogans in Northern Ireland, Belfast, and the Cosgroves in Northern Ireland, Belfast, is my family. That's my title, the Cosgrove and the Rogan coat of arms. I'm wearing those when I go there. I'm going to wear the Maui's crown and the Paramount Chief's title documents. Doctrines of discovery of Maui crown of the Pacific Islands and his crown estate title with King William the Fourth flag. We have a Maui crown flag and a King William IV crown land patent title. Britain, that's what I'm apostolizing to make it real. It is real, but I'm making it more real on documents. The documents I put together just recent in the last three weeks I'm taking them in or emailing them rather to my lawyer and then I'm going to go in and explain it to him how it works and what authority it has and who the fuck I am to say all those things about a king and claim the king's title. There is no king there yet. The king I'm putting in Westminster Parliament is King Ernest Augustus V. No matter what anybody says, it's up to me as King William IV Commercial Trading Bank business partner. Second party to him, first party. I'm nominating 
Ernest Augustus the fifth as our oath of office, King of Britain, UK, Hanover, Altair, New Zealand, Pacific Islands, and the Commonwealth countries of the world in 250 countries with this flag, legal authority, jurisdiction, and the Constitution, 1852 and 1846 constitutions, Britain to New Zealand, and our own Maui Constitution. A dual government, dual British, British New Zealand government called the Maui Federal State Government of the Commonwealth countries of the world. There, I said it. All I had to do is apostolise it and make it legal, legitimate, authentic, and justified as law. Okay? I think I've said enough about that. And to all those people watching in America, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, Britain, UK, I'm saying these things because you have no king, reigning monarch, running Britain. The Queen is in a rather corrupted position on the face of it. Cannot abdicate to Prince William and Prince William saying he has to get rid of a lot of people because there's too many humans on this earth is outrageous for a king, a future king, to say that. So he's not a king. A king won't talk like that. An arsehole of the world talks like that. And that's on Facebook. Everything on Facebook I take seriously. Whether it's crooked, I can tell. All the fake American media, CNN, all those medias are bullshit. They do that as a living. American, don't trust them. I don't trust any American at all, apart from my friend Daryl Payne and Renee Powers, I still reserve my right to make decisions through Britain first. Before I go there, I'm going to Philippines first. I'm going to the Philippines first because President Rodriguez Duterte has booted you bastard Americans off his land and booted the Rothschild banks right out of it. Good on you. All other countries should follow suit and wait for the Maui pound note. The British King pound note is safe. I'm going to shut down the Bank of England, bankrupt it, and the Rothschild banks with the Maui pound note. King Tafio's power note from Waikato, Manga Totali. Te Te Waikato, Whare Here in Manga. The Waikato Chief's power note. I'm going to bankrupt anybody inside who is tampering with our titles and our lands, our people, and our environment. If anyone is seen to be tampering with this earth, its atmosphere, its water, its bees, its birds, its fish, and its animals. You'll get bankrupted right off the worth in this country. You'll get bankrupted. Starting from you, Judas Collins, you bastard bitch. I can say that. Just the same as what President Duterte is saying, son of a bitch, Americans. I say, bitch of a bitch, Queen and Judith Collins, bullfrog. If Jeremiah was ever a bullfrog, you're the bullfrog. A female bullfrog. Dirty looking bitch, white face. Bitch. I say that. In all honesty, you are a crooked, 
thieving bitch. The same as John Key. He's another bitch that's defrauded this country. And he's sitting in the, the NZ Bank. The bank, he's liable to the bank. And he's also a director on in New Zealand. He's liable in New Zealand. I can bankrupt them. I can bankrupt them. I'm going to bankrupt Bailey's Real Estate and Barford and Thompson for tampering with my contracts. My private two-party contract with the landowners on Cook Street and the other properties that my daughter had at Barford tampered with those documents as well. I've got some other properties that have been tampered with too, especially the Monocal titles and the Wainwall titles down the East Coast on my land blocks. I've warned them <clears throat> near Waitane, you, you're going to get your ass fucking kicked off Maringaro T C12 block. I'm going to boot you, man. It's not your title. It's not your title. I warned you long ago. The time has arrived to start culling you lot out. You Maoris. You fucking Maoris. Have fucked this whole country up with your bullshit. Fuck about that. That's all I can say about it because I've gone right over Mohi Manikau's titles and Whakapapa and I've discovered all the other Whakapapas of Ngāti Whātua and that's where the crooked business is with Ngāti Whātua a uh, Crown Corporate of New Zealand and New South Wales, Australia Canberra now Commonwealth country of Australia fucking around with our 93 Te Turu Whenua Native Land Act and made their Native Land Act 93. Where did the 93 come from? It's only come from New Zealand. There's no other 93 Land Act in the world. Native Land Act in the world. And you stole the fucking name. I'm going to have you up for that too. I'm going to fucking bankrupt you lot. I'm going to go with those originates from Australia and we're going to deal to you. And in Indonesia have fucked up. Papua New Guinea, I'm going into Papua New Guinea and get their country back. Off you bloody dirty bastards that killed them, murdered them, and took their country under the Queen. Bitch title. I'm saying all these things because your time has come to be removed and locked up or burnt at the stake because of your crimes of church and state. The churches are stuffed as well, starting with the Vatican, the Catholic Church and the Church of England has fucked up a lot of lives, stolen a lot of land and turned it into profit for themselves. The church, that is. You're going to find the people will band up against you in the Vatican and the City of London and New York City, Washington DC. You're going to find yourselves toppled over by the King's people, the British King's common people. We're going back to square one and start all over again with the British and New Zealand dual government, native title. Corporate still. It'll be a long time before the corporate goes, but it's still there. We're going to seize all the corporates back into the Admiralty title flag jurisdiction where it came from in the first place. They've used this flag right through the world, the Queen, to steal our title through Maori. Maori, you knew what you're doing, Toe Henry and Peter Sharples, all you bitches. In the Maori Party, in the Maori, in the government, Shane Jones, all you fucking ratbags, Sunny Toe, I'm, I'm calling out your names. You've got a bounty on your head, a trillion pound bounty on your head on this video. True fact, cited evidence. If you can't produce a title in front of me and Lobo and Ngāpui, if you can't produce a title, a British deed title, 